All right, what's going on, everybody? Hope you're all doing well. Oh, man. We got some new stuff to talk about today, huh? Look at this, man. This is going to be nice. Uh, 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 I know Kabam didn't do this uh, for my new account challenges. <laughs> Obviously, right? But <laughs> this is going to be a nice addition to the new account challenges. Hell yeah. Um, Sweet, man. Digging this. We've got some battleground stuff to talk about. That's right, battlegrounds. Uh, I guess that's what they're going to be called. Uh, C Rob sending over a buck with the quickness, dude. C Rob, appreciate it, man. <laughs> Slap. Does the C stand for cool? If it doesn't, it should. Um. <clears throat> anyway, C Rob. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. Um, why does it look like my stream's buffering? I'm not. I'm not lagging at all. I have no Comcast issues or anything like that. But the playback for some reason appears to be buffering. There might not be an issue with YouTube going on here, man. Um, hold on. Let me pull open my own stream in a different browser here. No, it seems fine in my other browser. Okay, I don't know what's going. Uh, whatever. Don't think there's any lag. Anyway, hope you're all doing well. Um, let me get a tweet out so that we can get started. My first slap. Well, hey, like I said, man, I appreciate it. Thank you very much. Uh, BG new parry is a real issue. I've heard. I heard Android devices, huh? Oof, God, man, it's just one thing after another. I hear the Android devices are uh, struggling at the moment. Does the B and BG stand for buffering? No, it stands for cool. We were just through this, weren't we? <clears throat> it stands for cool. Uh, I was expecting you to be muted. Dude, I'm getting pretty good at checking these days. I was muted, um, like, you know, 30 seconds before I went live. But uh, after that, nope. Unmuted myself before the stream ever began. We good to go. Uh, Ryan, your face is frozen on my screen. Yeah, you might need to refresh. There's an issue. Here, let me. I'm gonna type it in the chat. Refresh if stream is lagging. I I I don't I don't know what's going on. I think there was just like a slight hiccup at the start of the stream. I'm not lagging at all though, so the stream should be good from here on out for everybody. We got no issues. Not on Comcast's end, not on, uh, what's it called? Um, my computer's end at all. OBS is good. Muted? Don't say muted. I know I ain't muted. Liar. Uh, for some reason on my Samsung, I don't have access to do arenas, which is really annoying. Just on your Samsung? No arenas at all? Wait, what? I didn't hear anything about that. All I heard was, like tons of gameplay issues um like parries worse than ever uh for people running android or something like that either way man uh i think we need to get a tweet out it's a i mean is, is this a little bit weird this button over here on the um i mean i guess it's not weird i guess it's kind of cool that it shows it always and it's like hey you know you could just tell looking at it uh what somebody's title is that's kind of, i mean it's kind of cool i guess i don't know i feel like <laughs> now anytime i see someone playing this game in real life which would be a first to be clear uh <laughs> if i see anyone playing in real life dude the first thing my eye is gonna go towards is what kind of title they got what symbol are they rocking uh but all right anyway let's get a tweet out mm -mm 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 -mm. Let's do it. Dearest. Yeah, Marvel Champions. Mm -mm -mm. Um, Battle Grounds. Um, 
Interesting. Very interesting. Yes. Oh no! Oh, I typed it out correctly. Life. Incredible. Tweet. Guys, that happens once a year, if that. <laughs> that might have been the first time ever. Um, now there must have been another time where I typed it out correctly, but man, I can't remember the last time that happened. Inc I mean. Technically, I still had to go back for the PS part, so it's not like it was a 100% perfect, but I mean, uh, just the I am now part, I am, I am pumped. Um, practice makes perfect, guys. If you don't get it on your first try, try 4,000 more times. Maximus, I don't know if I've seen long stream of profanity, parry, tired, lost a war fight, crashing out. Sup, buddy? Uh Maximus. Yeah, rip, dude. We were just talking about that. Uh, I don't have an Android device anymore, so I can't even test it out. Um, speaking of, dude, they announced, or, or not announced, but there was a leak of, like, the next budget phone from iOS. And from the one screenshot I saw, I only saw one screenshot, it looked like it had the old school uh, resolution, like the phone that I'm on right now. Which, oh my god, dude, I'm so excited uh, if that's the case. Uh, if it's like a cheap phone that has the old school resolution and all that, like, oh man, I'd be so pumped. I'd be so psyched. I did just get a new phone, but um, I, I, I used two phones. One strictly for streaming and recording, and the other as an actual phone. Um, but yeah, anyway. Uh... What are we rambling about? Yeah, Maximus, the power issues and stuff like that. Sucks, dude. Sucks big time. Happy to see BG being so excited. I am excited, dude. Today's a good day, man. I mean, listen, power issues aside, because, yeah, obviously that's not good. <laughs> but, um, the, like, the, 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 man. I, I'm just excited that we have something to look at today in, um,. Where is it? Cutscenes. Scrolled on down to the battlegrounds. Ooh, baby. Uh, I'm pumped, dude. That th it, like, if this is in game, then it can't be long. I'm assuming that this cutscene. Well, wait. I mean, I suppose it could still be a little ways out. But I, what I was gonna say is, I'm assuming that this cutscene was supposed to come out after 7.4. And I think 7.4 is March, which means I think Battlegrounds is April. Pure speculation. Don't quote me on it. Um, I, that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking solo competitive mode, now officially Battlegrounds until we, like, until we figure out if that's, like, um, the name of the... Because, all right, here's the thing with Battlegrounds, too. Battlegrounds is a term in other games that I've played, at least, like World of Warcraft, um, Man that kind of, like, goes around other game modes, you know what I mean? It's, it's like, like, there could be multiple different types of Battlegrounds, is what I'm getting at, you know, with more specific names to them. And I'm just excited, dude, for the first time in a while. I'm pumped, dude. I'm so pumped. Uh, I don't want to get my hopes up too high. I I'm happy if there's just one mode, and that one mode is just called Battlegrounds. I'm still happy. I'm still happy. But uh, there's a chance that it could mean that we've got multiple. Uh, there's a chance that it could mean in... A, a, in Oh, hold on. Matrix Multi. I was going to read your message after my little, you know, ramblings here. And I just happened to see it. Bald... Old grounds? Okay, dude. <sighs> Magix Multi, thank you for the dollar, but please take a lap at your earliest possible convenience. See you in 10 minutes. Son of a... Ugh, come on, dude. Oh. Okay, anyway. But it could mean that we have solo competitive and team competitive modes or something like that. There could be like a... Um... Well, we already know that there's going to be like a like a rating system, and uh, what's it called? Okay, uh, rating system and like a like a fun mode, right? 
But maybe there's like a like a regular rating, uh, like regular rating system, a fun mode, a tournament mode, which would be the result of the rating. I don't know, man. There's just possibilities on possibilities, and I love it. I love it. I love it. Uh, okay, we're okay with data mining and leaks now, because we usually aren't okay with spoiling story mode. Well, this is in-game. Uh, I don't normally like leaks, and I still would have preferred if this wasn't leaked. But, uh, this is in-game. Like, what are we gonna... It's... It's... It's different when it's leaked by Kabam in the actual game itself, you know? Uh, if someone else... Uh, was like, hey, look what I found digging through the game files. I'd be like, ah. Honestly, for Battlegrounds, I'd maybe still take a look at it. Because I'm, you know, it's what I've been waiting for. But, uh, I'd still be, uh, pretty disappointed. Uh, but this is in-game. So. BG just wanted to ask, since you're free to play, what would you recommend doing progression-wise after Act 4? Act 5, Yoda Yoda. But I'd recommend uh, doing Acts 1 through 4, 100% first. Um, yeah, I'd recommend doing all that stuff first. Um, you don't really leave story mode. I mean, you could do, like, temporary content, event quests, and stuff like that, of course. But as far as, like, like it's basically, like, story mode and back issues. Um are like, you know, the two different directions you can go. But don't do that until after you hit Cavalier. Uh, up until Cavalier, you pretty much just stay in story mode. Uh, EZ sent an overbox saying, Twitter if you please. EZ, let me see where you're at. Uh, 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 what do we have here? Let's see. Brain, two things to show you. Number one, notice who I'm missing from my five-star roster. Um, not a five star, not a five star, not a five star, not a five star. I mean, you know, trophy champions, not a five star trophy champs. Uh, dude, you got to get yourself into a uh, labyrinth or legends and then, tro dude, it's all trophy and not, you got them all. Got to catch them all. <laughs> you get, dude, you better hit the trophy store, man. <laughs> trophy store, maybe some incursion crystals for some of these guys. <laughs> Uh, but damn, dude. Hell yeah. Uh, he said two things as well. What is this? Number two, it's war card day. Oh, snap. Uh, nice, dude. Let's check out the war cards. Uh, Ruthless Relic. Uh, the Sith Lords, season 31. Dude, this looks cool. What the hell? I've never seen X-23 look like this. Uh, that looks awesome, though. <laughs> Meat48. I don't know why, but this username, I like it. <laughs> oh, man. Hey, he's a cool dude. I dig it. You know what's pretty sweet about Marvel that I don't always uh, acknowledge? It's been around for so long and in the hands of so many artists, both officially and, like, just, you know, fan art type stuff, that, like, the characters... They're very recognizable. Like, we all know this is, that this is Colossus, but, like, this is a very different Colossus um, than I've ever seen before. And, and it's just cool that there's so many different art styles for this stuff. Uh, but, yeah. Ooh. Hell yeah, dude. Some Psylocke action right there. Nice, nice, nice. Sweet. Uh, Eric Nelson sent it over a few as well, saying, Tweet! Eric Nelson, what do we got here? About to unit man my way through the last uh, paths in Variant 7 for the Tier 2 Alpha, but can this glory store reset already? Also, the units got resized. Thoughts? I'm happy. I'm very happy. The units, they were they were running off the screen before. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, I think on, on your particular device, because it's a, a wider device, maybe it looks, like, too small right here. So maybe they could dynamically change it based on device resolution or something like that. But the way that they were in the last update was not good. Uh, on, on, on my device, at least. <laughs> so, yeah, I'm happy with, uh, the UI overhaul. It looks good overall. But, dang, dude. Almost there. Almost there. Very nice. 
Scotty Lang sending over a book. Scotty, thank you very much. I don't see any message. I'm assuming that is another one for the Paseo Jar. Uh, thank you, dude. Another buck going towards Paseo. One day I'm gonna roll into Paseo and and just I'm gonna I'm gonna buy the whole place. <laughs> I'm gonna be like, hey man, I got this jar, and here you go. Here's the entire jar. I'll take one of everything for everyone in here. Uh, Scotty, thank you, dude. <laughs> Appreciate it, man. Maximus, I don't know if I've seen before sleep since art. Google Sam Keith Wolverine. You're welcome. Okay. All right. Let's see. Sam Keith Wolverine. Mm -mm -mm. Googling. Googling. Sam Keith Wolverine. Uh Oh. Oh, we've got a few images here. Hold on. Hold on. Let me grab a few of these guys before I put them on screen. Interesting. Very interesting. Okay, I've got some images. Uh, let's see. We'll go in the order that I clicked on them. What is this creature? This guy looks like he's uh, he like he he's got the genes of a of a juggernaut. Uh, inside of him. This is the, the thickest uh, Wolverine I've ever seen. This is like prehistoric Wolverine type stuff here, I guess, huh? Uh, that's what it looks like, at least. Yeah, oh yeah, this looks sweet, dude. Oh my god, all like the textures and stuff. How long does it take to do this stuff as an artist? Just like the little hairs, but making sure they actually look good instead of just some random uh, lines in different directions. <laughs> Look at this guy, dude. <laughs> this is like... This is like... Oh, man. Bologna on my sandwich? Oh. I don't know why, but that's that's the vibe I got from that. Uh, <laughs> but yeah. It looks sweet. Very unique art style, for sure. Very, very unique. Uh, Eric Nelson of another two saying, you didn't say thanks for being a member for 12 months. Oh my goodness, dude. Uh, did that message pop up? That did pop up. Oh man, I didn't say it. You're right though. But dude, that's the one year mark right there. Thank you, man. Uh, also, when is my banana going to grow? It must be like a few days early or something like that. It's got to be uh, like a few days away from the bush sprouting. Uh, but I don't know. It doesn't tell me, like, by the day. I'm just assuming that YouTube rounded it. And uh, a few days from now, you'll probably have the full-grown bush. Uh, what up, Pete? Jeans and jeans. Jeans and jeans. Sam Course, I don't know if I have Looney saying BG recently. I took down a, B a pretty beefy Electro. Honestly, I'm shocked I made it through. Okay, great. <laughs> <sighs> Sam, why do you do this? You know what to do, dude. Boo. All right, let's take a look at this battleground stuff, though, eh? So, uh, actually, hold on. I'm gonna I'm gonna skip it because who reads cut skin? Uh, cut skins? See, I did it again, man. Why did I say skins? I mean, technically there is <laughs> technically there is a C in it. But I swear to you, I was not imagining it as uh, saying it that way. Oh, God. Anyway. Cutscenes. <laughs> oh, you ever just feel really dumb? Really, really dumb? That's me every day. All right. Anyway, so this is in the, uh, this is in the official game here. In the cutscene section. And, um, yeah. It's basically Aegon... Or Karina and Aegon chatting it up. Um, and talking a little bit about some items here. Talking about some relics. Uh, it's interesting that that hammer... Isn't that hammer? Isn't that the, like the Beta Ray uh, Bill hammer? Or something? Uh, or is it not? Because, I mean, that guy lost the vote. Not to rub it in, in, in some salt and... The wounds of the Beta Ray Bill voters, but hold on. Beta Ray Bill. 
Uh, let's see. Um, it's not exactly, but it's kind of close, right? It's pretty. It's pretty damn close. I'd say, yeah, yeah. That's that's got to be the same one, right? Um, just like a different artist interpretation, kind of kind of thing. Interesting that she's holding that. Very interesting. Uh, can't open an MCOC on my phone after update? Dang, that's a bummer. Make sure to report that on the forums. I'm sure Kabam's already working on it, but, you know. Um, but, all right, all right. So, talking about some items here. We're not reading through the whole thing, man. It's in-game if you guys want to read it yourself. But um, they also use the word gal Galactorum. Uh, which, I mean, I'm guessing that's just like uh, an arena in the galaxy kind of thing. Is Galactorum, is that, a, is that an actual word? Uh, Galactorum. Oh my god, it is a thing. Holy crap. Alright, here we go. Check it out. Uh, the Galactorum. I feel like I'm not saying it the best way possible. Um, but anyway, it was an arena created by the Grandmaster on the orbit of... Ba Wait. Oh, wow. That's... This is... This is MCOC right here. So this is... Okay. I didn't realize that that was already a map in MCOC. Very interesting. Okay. 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 That's cool. Uh, rip my hopes and dreams for Beta Ray Bill. I'm sure he's going to get added at some point. There's really something... Uh, there's something really off-putting about Bill. I agree. Um, maybe it's because she has bangs. Haha, <laughs> just kidding. Terrible joke. Uh, he's talking about Karina. Hold on a sec, guys. I kid you guys not, I put a chip in me in the, the front pocket of my hoodie. Um because it fell on the on the ground outside and I didn't want to litter. Uh even though it's just food and like some bird would come around and eat it or something like that. So is it really even littering? Uh probably not, but I was like, uh, I don't know, I guess I'll pick it up. Um so I picked it up and I put it in my pocket, and um I forgot that I had it in my pocket. And I just put my hand in my pocket and crushed it. It was a, it was a full whole chip, and I just crushed it in my pocket right now. And I'm pretty mad, trying to hide my anger. But uh, I've got chip crumbs everywhere. <laughs> Sucks, man. All right. Anyway, so there is a Galactorum. The Galactor. How do you pronounce it, man? I'm pronouncing it wrong. I gotta be. Anyway. Uh, and they're putting Trico in charge, it seems, but teamed up with Aegon. Look at the way that they stare at each other, though, man. I mean, they gotta be in love, right? That second panel, the one in the middle. Look at that, man. But I trust you even more, Aegon. Um, that's what that is right there. I just... I just want to play it, guys. Can we just play it? Oh, man. Um, all right, hold on, hold on. There was a couple of super, chat, super chats here. Eric Nelson, five saying it's the time of the month again. Tweet. Okay, also, I see a tweet from Pete. Pete, what is this? Uh, rank four, big Paco boss? Oh, no. I mean, this guy's going to go down in two special twos. Here's the first one. Oh, you're not generating that much power back. Whoa. I guess you didn't really have any 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 buffs, so that makes sense. All right, but this is... There's going to be two more special twos right here. Here's the phase. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Let her rip. Yeah, that one dealt a bit more damage. Oh, man. Dang, dude. This guy actually has a lot of health. This is the most specials I've ever seen Pete have to do in a single fight. 
uh, it still took him a, a grand total of, uh, well, about 44 seconds. So, um, <clears throat> goes pretty strong. Uh, but yeah. Anyway, uh, Eric Nelson, let me see. Let me find yours. Uh, what is this? The floor trader outlet. I have two unwritten rules. I will find the floor trader outlet and I will destroy it brick by brick. <sighs> How do you tell a store to take a lap? Is that possible? Oh, man. Anyway, Sam sent over another five. Sam, P.S. I fully recovered from COVID. I guess I'm now allowed to drink since I survived Corona. <laughs> oh, man. All right. You know what? Was that intended? I, you know, I just realized. I thought you were uh, actually psyched to, to drink Corona. I just realized, no, you're not actually drinking Corona. You're just telling a, a terrible joke. You went outside, BG? I did go outside. I went uh, over to Paseo. Like this. Just kidding, I didn't go to Paseo. <laughs> uh, P, wait on. Brain... Uh, imagine not banning Ghost and placing a Pac boss against the MF Pan and Man's Peters. On a related note, two tweeters, please. So there was a second tweet. Let me see. This two. Uh, oh, what? Okay. Well, I mean, that wasn't the whole fight, but what the hell? <laughs> what the hell, dude? What? P can't phase recoil. SMH my head. Ah, PWF. Don't rub salt in the wound. Oh, man. All right. So, anyway, the cutscene here it ends with talking about putting someone else in charge or something like that. Do you, guys, do you think that this means, uh, do you think that this is like the teaser for a tournament type of thing right here? Uh, from amongst you, the citizens of the battle realm, a third judge will be selected. I can't tell if this means that they're going to put like one of the actual heroes in charge, you know, so it's going to be like guillotine or something like that. Uh, or if it means like. No, like an actual player uh, is, is going to have some kind of say in how the battlegrounds go once they're crowned. Uh, this judge will be chosen from amongst you, the champions of the battle realm, and serve a short term before replaced with someone new. You'll be judging none other than the summoners themselves and deciding whether or not they are worthy to hold relics of immense power. See, when it says you'll be judging none other than the summoners themselves... That makes me think that it's not going to be a player as, like, the other judge. It makes me think that there's going to be, like, different themes. And, like, one month is, like, you know, uh, Colossus and its X-Men theme. Then it's going to be Spidey and, you know, Spider-Verse theme or something like that. Um, solo competitive mode? Yeah, they're talking about solo competitive mode here. They're talking about solo competitive. Um, hold on, Eric Nelson sent over another two. Saying I'll send the next joke next month. Oh man, a damn store, dude. Not if I get to it first. I really shouldn't say things like that because what if something did happen to it? Good night, everyone. Heading out already on the mother. All right, later, dude. Uh, Sam's in over another bug saying, honestly, doing a lot better now. That's good, though, dude. Uh, that is really good. I am back at work, missing birthdays and important events because I'm working instead of uh, being because I'm sick now. Uh, so I'm no lifing MCOC at night and working in the day. <laughs> Sounds good, man. Hey, man. Congrats on no longer being sick. For the record, I think Battlegrounds is book three, act eight. Book three? 
We're moving on to book three. Um, no. I mean, you know, obviously not book three, but you, but you are like, I can't tell how, like, I can't tell if there's any sincerity in that message at all. If it's like uh, just trolling, because you did say book three, or if you actually mean like, um, act eight, like this is act eight kind of thing. Because I never really thought about it, that it could be act eight, but I don't think it is. Uh, all right, so send word to all corners of the battle realm, summoners, and champions alike. Prove your worth, show your valor, and emerge uh, victorious at the battlegrounds. Nah, man. It's the... They're talking about the, the Galactorum. They're talking about putting uh, the original champion of MCOC, Aegon. Uh, you know. He's partnered up with Trico with judges and stuff like that. Um, yeah, man. Uh, yo, bald man. Doctor is lovely. Shall the streak live? Wait, what? Doctor is lovely. <laughs> Shall the streak live? Well, this I think the streak would have to start again if you if you're looking to start another streak. Uh, I don't remember. Oh, crap, I don't remember now who it was last night, but. Um, who was it last night? Oh, I think it was Jim last night, right? Or was that the night before? All these days, they blur together, man. But, okay, anyway, let's go hit the arena. I'm excited, man. I'm excited. The mention of relics tells me that uh, it is the solo competitive mode. Yeah, everything just, it, it just, it screams solo competitive, right? Oh, oh, yeah, yeah, Dominican Republic, DR, duh, 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 duh. Dude, I read it DR the first time that you said it, and for some reason today I read it as doctor. Oh my god, you know what? Oh, all right. Listen, guys, today is not my best day. <laughs> Let's just get that out of here right now. It ain't my best day. <laughs> But, um, uh, yeah, dude, enjoy DR, man. Enjoy it, dude. Uh, anyway, let's, let's start the grind here. Let's go. It was a magic gym last night? Okay, I thought so. But, you know, like I said, the days, they blur together, man. Uh, hey, buddy, what's up, Karate Michael? Saying couldn't help but notice that you have 2 million loyalty and zero six-star unstoppable colossi. What freaking gives? <laughs> Mike, you fool. You don't know what's coming, do you? Seven-star unstoppable colossus. The first seven-star to be released in the game will be unstoppable colossus. Why? Because you can't stop that, man. Yeah. Really hope Kabam isn't thinking about doing relic packs in the future. Um, I'm sure they will be doing relic packs in the future. You're talking about like 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 selling stuff. Uh, uh, I mean, we already know relics are coming. We don't know exactly how they'll look. We know they're not going to change the appearance of our characters. We know it's going to be something very different than uh, what happened in their failed uh, title, Realm of Champions. Because why would they, why would, I mean, it failed over there, right? So it's going to be something different here. How different? We don't know. I mean, plus it's just different people working on it, right? Um, but I would imagine they're going to be selling that stuff too. Uh, uh, I, I'm not saying that they should sell everything they can. I'm just saying it's Kabam and that they will sell everything they can. Uh, but all right, uh, Messiah, dude, Messiah, I don't know, over 20, saying, I still claim the streak nine days running, it was a hell of a streak, hashtag Messiah from on, hashtag bold, uh, bold man, uh, what? Bold man new moves cap? What? Is that what that says? I can't 
<laughs> so, what? Bold, bold main, bold, bold manu moves cap. I think. I think that's what that says. Hashtag BJ hates all caps. Hey, listen. I reviewed cap early, early first look at least at cap yesterday in the uh, looking at Dave's deep dives. He looked pretty solid. He actually looks kind of solid, man. Not that I'd play him all the time, but uh, you can't say I hate all caps. He looks pretty good. Uh, you're telling me to take a lap? What in the world is this? Uh, <laughs> but anyway, dude, Messiah, thank you, man. Bald man removes caps. Uh, okay, okay. Okay, okay, all right. Well, there was a couple letters missing. You can't blame that on me. Uh, <laughs> listen, I have a hard enough time reading what all the letters are there, okay? If there's if there's any of them missing, that's that's me. Uh, or, that, or that's it's gonna make me struggle. Why suicides? Uh, what? For masteries? Saying what masteries? Why suicides? Why, how do people have five star rank four champions uh, 11k rating okay yeah so masteries they increase your champions pi um, and the suicide masteries happen to have the largest increase uh, of the masteries or of like the different mastery builds at least um, and yeah it, it, pi doesn't really matter it, it, it's just an imaginary number don't pay any attention to it it's all about the um, the rank and level of your champion uh, and sig level rather than the uh, the PI. PI yeah, is just there as like an approximation of power. So, uh, Scotty Lang sending over another buck. This can't be another Paseo buck. At Sam Frazier has been good spacing out his Twitter check requests. Okay. Uh, Samuel Frazier. Let me see. What's up, PG? Can I get a Twitter check, please? Okay. Samuel. Absolutely. Um, if I could find you. Which, I don't think I can. Uh, wait. I see one here from Mummy. Going to bed early tonight, but I want to keep the streak. So, here's today's animations. Hulk smash. Dang, dude. I love the style of these animations. They're so cool, dude. They're, like, simple, yet effective. I like it. Um, but okay, hold on. I'm gonna double check here, Samuel, but I, I, I don't think I have a tweet from you. You have a different... Oh, I lied! I lied! Here it is. I have to double check. Let me see. I uh, got these from the unit deals today. Uh, must say, I'm satisfied with what I got. Uh, ooh, new six-star morning star. Okay, okay. And the five-star kitty. Hell yeah. Well, congrats, man. That's awesome, dude. Two brand new champs. Very nice. Uh, John Schlamp sent it over a book. And that's why he bans people for all caps. Wait, what? Uh, Battle rounds could be a tournament style summoner showdown thing. I think it will be. Kind of. But I also think it's like the new game mode. I think that's solo competitive mode. Um. But hold on. That's why he bans for all. For Is, are you talking about my inability to read? Is that what you're saying? I ban people for all caps because I, I can't read them. No comment. Uh, Eric Nelson sent over to you saying, Penny in war sucks, so tweet. Okay. What do we got going on here? Start of that Penny mini boss fight that we talked about last week. Check comments for part two. Um, yeah, man, this is a over two minute video. I can't watch it over two minute video. Uh, it takes way too much out of the chat. Hold on. Part two, here's part two. Uh, also have Spidey99 uh, fight against Magog on Aspect of Evolution tonight, so wish me luck. Good luck, dude. And yeah, this does look like, this is, 
I I don't like Penny. I don't like that she's in MCOC. Uh, not hating the character. I'm just saying, like, look what you have to do to fight this character. It's not fun. Uh, I really wish they designed the champ in a different way. Um, and I'm sure over time there's going to be, like, other better counters and stuff like that. But, like, ugh, it's just not fun. Um, grats though, dude. It looks like you made it through. I mean, you said you made it through, right? Just that it was a super long fight. Yeah. Nice, dude. Very nice. Uh, Sam so sending over another buck as well. So I'm going to bed, and I've been asked a very mattress question. So I'm gonna sleep on it. Night, Sam. Take a lap before you go. It'll help you sleep. Ugh. What? Ugh. Match? Okay. Anyway. Sam. Yo, BG. Thank God for your revive farm video. I've been needing that. Thank you. Hey. Glad it could help, man. BG, can I get a MySpace check? Sure. What's your MySpace? Uh, broccoli designer? Broccoli did not design Penny. Um, I know who designed Penny, and I don't want to say who it was, because I don't want anybody to put a flaming bag of poo on their doorstep. Uh, but that one was not Broccoli's. Broccoli did, uh, des he did design some very annoying to fight champions. <laughs> uh, he designed Mysterio with his wild heavies. Designed Fury with his two lives. Designed Mangog with his uh, ridiculous special two. But uh, he was not in charge of one Miss Penny Parker. Penny is way too cracked on D. I had a three plus minute path fight against her and war on path 7B a few wars back. So much hitting to her block. Yeah, it's just not fun, dude. It's really not fun. Like, if you have to do that one time in the fight. That would already not be a fun thing to do. But it'd be like, okay, you only got to do it once. Fine. Fine, I'll do it, all right? But the fact that you got to do it, like, several times over, like, oh, my God. Oh. Crap, it was the same designer as Professor X. My bet it was the same designer as Professor X. Um... Of which I'll say who designed Professor X on another day. <laughs> when we're only talking about Professor X. Because again, I don't want any flaming bags of poo on that designer's doorstep. Uh, Eric Nelson sent him another two. Saying, at Karate Mike, did you see what I had to go through over three minutes? Uh, I wasn't wanting to watch it all. I just wanted you, know, you to get the difficulty of that fight. Oh, I, I'm fully aware. I've fought pennies before. There's a penny mini boss in. Wait, is there it. Hold on, is there a is there a penny mini boss in map eight? I think there is, right? Um, but I'm just trying to think. I don't think I actually fought that penny. Uh, I was fighting a Spidey 2099 in um. In map 8. I don't remember if there's a penny or not. Yes, there is? Okay. Penny is a boss, not a mini boss. Well, f fine. Fair enough. But there's, like, more than one boss. Uh, she's she's one of the bosses. So, yeah. You're right. It's not a mini boss. There's just multiple bosses. Um, okay, yeah. I don't think I fought that penny in particular. What? There was a really annoying... I mean, I have fought Annoying Pennies before, but I don't remember where now. Was it just the monthly? I don't think it was just the monthly, but... I mean, even the monthly was annoying. Uh, Dubvon sent over two saying, what do you call a crazy monkey? Bananas. I don't know. Is this even a joke? I don't... Uh, Dr. Devon, no, dude. Who? Uh, Sam sent it over to the buck as well. Sam, 
Don't, don't, don't do it again, man. Not another one, dude. You're not even taking these laps, I don't think. Let me see. Honestly, I'm so tired, but I can't sleep. So I'm going to do a bunch of jokes and spam super chats. I mean, there was no joke in this one, which I appreciate, but oh, why? Is there someone... Does anyone have some Ambien that they can just sh share <laughs> for, for Sam here? Let him get some rest. Not, not because of the joke thing. Just because, you know, recovering from COVID. Yeah, uh, you know, you got to catch up on your, on, your, on your rest there. I'm looking out for you on this one, you know? <sighs> uh, imagine Jim sending over 10. Jim? Don't. Why isn't the entire stream doing this? Why? I already know. I don't have to read Jim's message to know I'm not going to like it. Right, let's see. Hey, Brian, what do you call a Batman who no longer goes to church? Christian Bale. I'll take a lap. Good. I can turn the stream off at any minute, people. Any minute. When is solo competitive? Um, I don't know, but I was just thinking before that uh, the cutscene that was leaked in this, uh, or, or that was leaked in this update, uh, it I think it was supposed to come out after 7.4, but all the, like, there's no way for us to really know when that cutscene was supposed to come out, but I think at the end of 7.4, uh, and I think 7.4 is coming next month, not this month, unless Kabam's just really late in announcing it. Uh, and if that's the case, then I think Battlegrounds would be released in April. Um, but we don't really know. Luckily, Tom isn't here. I know. You know, at least we don't have the ringleader himself present at the moment but still ah oh, man all right craig already sent it over a bug saying did someone say joke day no one literally no one said joke day you're the only one that said it craig don't like is there did you guys have a meeting beforehand or something like that i don't even understand how does this happen Everything was fine. I was. I said today was a good day. Because we finally got something. Even though it wasn't an official announcement about the solo competitive mode. We got the leak in-game about Battlegrounds, which I think is a solo competitive mode. So it was, a, it was a great day. Spoiled by puns. Uh, Sam sent it over another buck. Sam, don't do it. Okay, I won't pull any funny stuff on you. Brian, how are you? How is Laura? What'd you have for dinner today? Any plans for cool videos in the works? There's actually not any jokes in here. Unless something went over my head. Well, in that case, today's a good day. <laughs> for the reasons I was just saying. Laura's good. Uh, for dinner. What did I have for dinner today? Um... What did I have for dinner today, man? I had a bunch of, like, uh, snacky type stuff, man. Um... I didn't eat, like, an actual dinner. I just, had, I just kind of grazed on some snacky type stuff, man. Not the healthiest. Uh, I mean, as I was just saying before, I just pulled a chip out of my pocket. So, you know, had some chips and uh, some other Wait, hold on. Had some pickles. Um, what was the rest of that message? Uh, any plans for cool videos in the works? Yes, but those I can't talk about. I have plenty of plans for cool videos. Uh, and I want to talk about stuff so bad, but I can't. On account of what happened last time where it took, like, uh, years longer than I expected to make a video. That was actually cool, you know? But, 
dude i'm working on, on on big stuff is all i could say yes stuff is being worked on uh sam thank you dude eric nelson sent it over to you as well saying everyone spam tom to summon him is that even how it works is he beetlejuice or something i don't think that's how it works tom's probably um he's probably watching some like romantic comedy with his girlfriend or something like that you know with his girlfriend that he supposedly has <clears throat> i don't know why i put that in quotes uh dub devon sending over another buck thank you dude wait i don't see any other message from you There's no other message, unless it got eaten by the YouTube machine, but if... Oh, wait, hold on. Oh, man, when I refresh the page... No, that still doesn't do anything. When I refresh the page, it took... It, it changed my uh, chat options, but I changed it back, and there's still nothing there. So, YouTube might have e ate that message. I'll, um... I'll check again in a few if you want to type it out again. What do you think of the UI updates now? I think they look a lot better with the small add-ons. I think they look a lot better too. Let's go take a look. Overall, I think it looks much better. It looks like they 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 got something that like kind of rushed out previously. And now uh yeah, now it looks a lot better. The there's like a little framing thing around the the menu. Um it's a little odd, the, like the positioning of that, of like the title icon, but at the same time, I'm not really mad at it. I think it works. Um, to go into this, th like this page is awesome. I love this page. I'm so excited to, to use this in like the new account challenges. Um, where like, honestly, like, seeing this page makes me want to go for Thronebreaker on my next new account challenge, you know? Like, it's... Because it, why would I want to stop short? Why would I want to stop on, on Cavalier? You know what I mean? If we're going challenge or contend or prove and conquer or uncollected Cav, then we just fizzle out? Nah, man. We need to go Thronebreaker. But also, I, I mean, I think there's going to be an addition to this in uh, at the end of 7.4, possibly. Uh, I hope there is at least. So we might we might still be stopping short one way or another, because I'm sure on a new account challenge like Thronebreaker is already going to be challenging enough uh, to go beyond that. Like, no, nah, not even possible, right? Oh, the page is a prelude to the next. Yeah, yeah, I hope so too. But overall, I, I, the UI update it looks much much better. Just these little things about it. I really add up. The units are no longer running off the edge of the screen, um, which I like. The, you know, I heard there was a UI update before I logged into the game today. <laughs> today. And um, anyway, I originally when I heard that, I thought people were talking about uh, the like this, like this page right here, like the whole book selection little funkiness to this menu um i don't know why I, I i thought that that's what people were talking about but yeah anyway still waiting for something like that but uh it's good man i like it i do like it uh craig hardy sent another buck saying is that a broken chip in your pocket or are you just happy to see me okay i don't even under what I mean, it's not a pun, so you know what? I'm not going to boo it. Um, but wow, is I guess what I'm going to say. Because what else can I say about this? The broken chip is out of my pocket, by the way. But wow. Uh, hold on. Did you ever... Let me see. Oh, here we go. You can't send messages with dollar tips. Uh, well, yeah, I know, but usually when someone uh, sends a dollar, there's like another message 
for me to find. Uh, you said, but hey, I was going to mention Domides' video that popped up in my feed. Uh, laughing my ass off. Oh, man. Well, that's good. Trolling. That, that trolling SOB, dude. Uh, Magic Jim, sign over 10, saying, hey, Brian, give some love to Laura, Dragon, Padme, Cat, Starfighter, Liza, uh, Anima, and all the amazing women of this community. Hold on, I'm not familiar with the last one. Um, YouTube channel? Or... I don't know if I'm familiar with the last one. Probably, I mean probably seen them around but uh hold on uh i just typed the name into youtube i'm not seeing anything coming up so i'm not sure who that is but i agree with you nonetheless Shout out to all the uh, the the lovely ladies of MCOC. Uh, we need more. <laughs> there's too many. There's too many dudes. <laughs> it's good to have uh, a little 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 bit of uh, both sides. A little bit of diversity. You know what I mean? Didn't hear Pixie Bell on that list. Dang, Clarissa. <laughs> But I'm not, yeah, uh, I'm waiting for, for you to let me know who that who that last one is. There are more, by the way. It's not like that's a complete list, uh, which, you know, I know Jim knows that too. It, it's, it's just, you know, those are the ones in particular that he can fit in the message. There's only so many characters that you could fit in a, uh, in a super chat message. He, he squeezed in as many as he could. But yeah. Um, Alright, Sam. Sending over a couple as well, though. Sam. Sam, last two. Uh, I will say that the video was well worth the wait, so I'm glad to hear it. Question, if Mr. Sinister with suicides is attacking another Mr. Sinister... Then the attacker uh, clips the defender with special one. Then the defender clips the attacker with special one. Who has the debuffs now? Oh, God. Hold on. Which one was the attacker again? Uh, question. Mr. Sinister attacking. Another Mr. Sinister. Then the attacker clips the defender with special one. Then the defender clips the attacker with special one. Who has the debuffs now? The attacker does. Haha. -ha. Solved your riddle. It wasn't even. It wasn't even. Was it even a riddle? <laughs> It was, it was really not that hard to figure out, but I don't think it was an actual riddle. But I got it anyway. <laughs> oh, man. Um, but yeah, Sam, thank you for the two. I feel like that could easily turn into a um, woodchuck saying right there. You know, like the how much wood could woodchuck chuck if woodchuck could chuck wood? How many Mr. Sinister debuffs could a Mr. Sinister toss onto a Mr. Sinister if a Mr. Sinister could toss debuffs? Something like that. Uh, Derpy Creature sent over two saying, hey man, check Twitter please. Trying for uncollected. Mm, Derpy Creature, give me one sec here. Holy. We did it, we survived. Uh, Derpy Creature. Do you have a different name on YouTube, uh, on Twitter, I mean? Because I don't see anything here, man. I got nothing. I do have this picture here, though. Not from Derpy Creature. Uh, what's the common thing between a burnt pizza, frozen beer, and pregnant woman? Uh, what? Okay. All right. What? Anyway, here's a picture, uh, which does look quite nice. It's a good looking Keanu Reeves right there. Didn't even need to tell me the name for me to understand it. Oh, 
Hold on. Derpy creature. It's Derpy Creature on Twitter. Yeah, man. I don't have a tweet from you then. Uh, make sure your Twitter's not set to private. Um, and make sure you tagged me in the tweet. If your Twitter was set to private, then you have to uh, uh, make your Twitter account publicly viewable and send the tweet again. I got nothing here. Dragons. Yeah, you know, over a book. Sam BG, I only have 35 five star champs left to rank two. Three months ago, I had more than 75 one rank one five star champs. Progress being made. That's big progress, Dragon. Feeling darn good about my arena grinding status. Got a while to catch up to you, though. In the arena, yes, but you also have more champions in total than I do, so. Uh, to be fair, in all fairness. But yeah. That's pretty good. That's pretty good. You're going to have to get them all to rank 3 <laughs> after uh, getting them all to rank 2 and stuff. But that's not bad. Not bad at all. What was the Battlegrounds leak? Well, loves beans. Um, it's in-game right now. Uh, this uh, in the cutscenes here. We don't, we don't know exactly what this is, but all signs point to uh, the solo competitive mode. Um, it seems like it. Kind of goes on to talk about some relics. Uh, it talks about... Um, what's it called? The, the, the shinies right there, man. That or, or maybe they're talking about Pokemon. I'm not sure. I can't tell. When they say, uh, say shinies like that. But um, looks like Aegon's going to be teaming up with the uh, the champion, Trico. And yeah, they're in the Galactorum. Uh, all right, hold on. Easy. Send it over a buck as well. Easy. Where are you at? Have an MCOC joke for you. What goes A, no, B, no, C, no, D, no, E, no, F, O, thank God. Me farming revives on 3.2.6. Wow. What do we do here, guys? Do we boo it? I mean, it was an MCOC joke. It was an original. It wasn't a pun. Um, I don't think we boo it, right? But it wasn't good. So we're we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna ask the audience on this one. Uh, was Easy's original MCOC joke funny? If if the votes say no, then on your way to that next revive. I'm afraid there's a lap in your future. <clears throat> ah. Oh, man. The early votes are, are leaning towards no. <laughs> I, don't I don't know why. This makes me, this makes me happy. <laughs> People voting no on whether the, whether the joke was funny or not makes me pretty happy. It makes me feel like I'm on a... Uh, this is like a... A talent show right here. America's got talent. MCOC's got talent. There we go. Oh, it looks like the votes are in. Take a lap. <laughs> I'm going to ban every one of you buttholes. Wow, dude. <laughs> Mod abuse. Uh, Patrick Mark 705. Patrick, thank you, dude. Saying is Omega. 
worthy of a six star generic awakening gem over ghost slash corvus uh, i do run suicides but can only sig him up to 100 um let me see omega worthy of six star generic um that's a tough call man i i do think omega is still very strong he doesn't get talked about nearly as much as he used to but then again neither do ghost or corvus um the the game's kind of expanded uh, uh, for like viable options um at the at the at the high end and at the low end too or whatever because like you know champs got buffed and stuff but just saying like it, it feels like every single day corvus 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 that was like the only talk in town you know whereas now it's like well yeah but there's also hercules and other champs and stuff right um and same thing for ghost and same thing for omega red but they all are still good i do think they're all worthy of generic awakening gems still um especially when running suicides maybe only when running suicides actually because i don't know i don't think they're worth it without running suicides but um yeah omega red still still worthy of the generic as far as if you should feed omega the generic like oh man i can't really answer that for you um comes down to like you know play style preference um what you actually need like in war if no one else is playing ghost it's good to have someone in your battle group that's a ghost uh player but also likewise for o uh, omega red if someone else is already playing ghost it could be good to uh diversify and and pick omega red um i mean none of those options have good prestige so i prestige is not really a factor um i don't know if you run a five if you already have a five star omega red i would say at sig 100 i would rather use a sig 100 omega red over a sig 200 five star but it's still fairly close to the point where it's like maybe hold on to the materials until you can get them to like sig 140 or something like that and then it really becomes clear that the six star is much better um and up until then just use the five star uh yeah it's that's that's a that's a pretty personal decision overall though but i can tell you yes the champion is still six star generic awakening gem worthy and if you plan on feeding him sigs in the future then um you know yeah you could do it now but also what happens if like while you're waiting to get those sigs you pull the champ again you could save yourself a generic so if you are already running a five star version of the champ then uh i'd say there's no rush in committing to the six star at sig 100 uh hope that helps that's a not an easy decision to make and like i said largely just a, a personal one yeah looks rad hopefully kabam doesn't f it up i agree man yeah i don't think they are gonna f it up uh the battlegrounds thing i think you're talking about but we'll see that bum dreamin's next rank four is corvus can we get a poll on booting him oh man no because knowing dreamin he'll never let that go if i make a poll even if i voted like no in the poll he would forever the next time i i i, I talk to him what do you mean you made a poll talking about uh, booting me or what i can't do a dreaming impression that was a terrible dreaming impression but yeah anyway dear pretty creature i uh, it looks like i have a tweet from you now saying hey man here's my champs i'm rocking okay and i think you said that you were close to uh uncollected or pushing for uncollected hold on let me read your original message one more time here hey man check twitter please trying for uncollected okay okay and i'm assuming you want some advice um uh, here's my champs i'm rocking okay let's see so excellent you've got hercules ranked up that is excellent you've got mole god ranked up uh double excellent uh okay 
Okay, so I don't know where you're currently at on your way to Uncollected, but I'm assuming you're either at the Masochism Quest or approaching the Masochism Quest. Because usually once people can overcome that hurdle, they can they can make the push through Bane and uh, cross the Uncollected finish line. Um, so if Masochism, which is Act 5.2.4, if that's still uh, on the table for you, uh, I would say this is going to be one of your MVPs. Uh, if not your actual just MVP, uh, APOC right here. So here's what you want to do. You want to, you want to max out this APOC as soon as you possibly can. And then you're going to have five champions on the team total, right? Now, once you, like the deeper and deeper you get in this game, you're going to need more than five champions. Uh, even though you can only have five, uh, you know, on your team in a quest, right? But early on... And I would say uncollected is is still early on enough um, that you that you can mostly just run like the same five champs. Maybe you're swapping out like one champ for I don't know an immunity or something like that. But for the most part, you get five champs going. Those are the five champs that you use. And um, uh, later on, as you pull more resources, you can get uh, more variety ranked up. So the five that I'd recommend running are Mole God, uh, Spidey Ham, Hercules, Apoc, and then don't rank up Cable, but put him on the team. You you want Cable just for the, the, the supporting synergy for Apoc. It'll make him significantly stronger right away at the start of the quest. Uh, and then, yeah, th like these are the four champs they'll actually be playing. Apoc, um... Mole God, Spidey Ham, and Hercules. That's what I'd recommend doing. Uh, yeah. And you could run that same team for, like, every quest leading up to Uncollected. So, I hope that helps. Uh, I don't know if you have any mutant rank-up resources that you could feed to that APOC, but that is um, the best advice I got for you. Good luck in your push. Good luck. BG, do you recommend Suicide Masteries for those who are uh, not as of yet uncollected? Uh, kind of? Um, it'd be pretty tough to get all the units and stuff like that, I imagine. It, Suicide Masteries, it really depends on the champions you're using more than anything, though. Wait, is Dream back in 4 Loki? No, he's not. Uh, but I, I, he Natch uh, is not in 4 Loki either. The he Natch and... Um, uh, Dreamin are in the same alliance. Uh, Brandon Dawson, Senator Robux, saying, Listen, Jugs is the best champion to use a generic on. Ugh. Especially when BG refuses to open a featured. Oh, my God. Why'd you have to remind me about that? Uh, not one, but two. Hmm. <sighs> That was the darkest period in MCOC that we've ever experienced. People actually um, using uh, generics on Juggernaut. Six star. Hold on, what is that spam message? Keeps coming up, man. I'm gonna put. I'm gonna add that in. Uh, I'm gonna try to get rid of that permanently if I can. Um, thank you to the mods for getting rid of it, but let me, let me see if I can set this up so that you guys don't have to get rid of that one, that particular one at least, ever again. Okay. Should be good to go now. Uh, Derpy Creature sent over another buck saying, Rip, I'm on 5.1.5, and thanks for the advice. Yeah, I mean, okay, that falls that falls in line with what I was thinking. Uh, 5.1.5, yeah, so I would say 5.1.5 is not that bad. Um, 5.1.6 is kind of tough, though. Um, I mean, you might be having a hard enough time with, with the fifth quest as it is, but, you know, I'm just saying, like, I don't want to lie to you and, and, and give you some false hope or something like that. The next quest, uh, the sixth one, is um, definitely a step up in difficulty. 
Uh, but then you have a, like a kind of a little bit of a break for like the first few quests in chapter two. And then I would say the fourth quest, uh, masochism, that, that's, that's really the toughest one. But then, uh, you've got the last two quests run collected that'll have the Bane node. And that one's also kind of tough to deal with. So you've got, you've, you've got, um, you've got a little bit ahead of you. You've got a little bit of a journey ahead of you. Take your time with it. No rush. Save up some resources. Try to get that APOC ranked up. And yeah, good luck. Jason Wild Bunch with the 14 months in a row. Jason, thank you, dude. Saying ABG, how are you? Did I miss anything? RIP to that ship you killed earlier. Wow. Really? Well, it sounds like you didn't miss a damn thing if you know about the chip. <laughs> oh, man. Why you gotta say it like that, dude? RIP to the chip you killed earlier. Ugh. Uh, I did crush it. But anyway, <laughs> dude, I'm good, man. Hopefully you're doing good as well. Uh, thank you for the 14 months. Josh Slap said it over seven and them Canadian bucks as well, saying I've been summoned. What? Been summoned? By who? Court? You got uh, some jury duty or something like that? They got that up in Canada land. Um, I mean, I was joking, but you know what? That's actually a legit question now. How how does that is that is that similar to how it works in the states, where you just got to go to jury duty every so often whenever they summon you? Uh, I'm looking at the past messages though. I don't see who summoned you and for why. Uh, Messiah said in 05 as well, saying, so rumor has it, new sigil champ. What? Is there a new sigil champ rumored? I didn't hear anything about this. Is that legit, or are you just uh, doing a little Messiah trolling over here? Hashtag Messiah from Mod, hashtag BG hates all caps. Hashtag it's pun day. Oh man, it does feel like it's pun day with all the terrible jokes. Uh, it's pun day people. Hashtag jugs rank up. Hashtag BG feature pop? Question mark. That's a big no. Jury duty is universal. <laughs> okay, so there's no escaping it. Um, is there actually a new sigil champ though? Oh, you start talking about jugs. Okay, I understand now. Okay, okay, okay. I got you. I got you. It's all clicking now. Holy, what's the best way to throw a party on Venus? Just plan it. <sighs> Thank you, Shlerum, for the spectacular joke. Dude, Campbell, get out of my face. He's dead. Uh, ew, I have jury duty at the end of the month. Hell of a birthday present. Ah, uh, man. Jury duty sucks. Uh, it's been some talk in chat tonight. You may have a clue. I don't. I hope there is a new sigil champ, though. Uh, just some guys in, in KT stream was, uh, saying about new, new Sigil Champ. Okay. Okay. Gotcha. No, I haven't heard that yet. Oh, God. I could have thrown a special and ended it. Hey, what up, lags? New caps look, new cap looks pretty sick. He looks pretty good, man. Yeah. I don't, I mean, I was only looking at him, uh, last night from Dave's video, from the, from the deep dive video. And, um... He didn't seem like he he was going to deal some crazy damage, so he didn't seem like a champ that would get played all the time. But he seems like in uh, an alliance war, and potentially solo competitive, or battlegrounds, if that's the name for it, um, then yeah, he could be useful. He's like a PvP uh, champion. That's the way I look at him. Feels like he's going to be good for PvP content. 
Claim that. Uh, these 327 watching this will play this game. Uh, yes, everyone in here plays this game. Or most people at least play this game, yeah. If that's what you're asking, I can't tell. Uh, how many units you get from one arena? Uh, well, there's three different arenas. One of the, I think, so two of them give 135 units each. And then I think the other one gives, two, does it give 270? Is it 540 in total? Um, I think that's it, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I, or is it 535? Actually, I think it might be 535. Mm, I don't remember in total. But yeah, there's three of three different arenas that give units. Seems like five out of five utility champ. Yeah, exactly, dude. Five out of five utility. Uh, I'm on Android, and the game has been fine all day. Really casual casual. Interesting. Uh, I've heard from a lot of people on Android saying today is like the worst day they've played in a long time. Uh, John Schlamp and over 14 more of them. Can any bug saying BG hates cap? What? Ban me hashtag caps lock. Wow. Even when I say nice things about cap, that's all I get is, is cap. That I hate cap. What the heck? Been summoned three or four times, but never participated. Came home early from vacation to sit in a room. And I usually just uh, call on the day before, and they don't need you. I don't know if I've ever called in, and they told me that they didn't need me. Because, yeah, it's been a while. I mean, I hope I'm not jinxing myself. I don't know if it's because I moved or what, but it's it, it has been a while since I did get that, uh, uh, that little paper in the mail. But basically... Um, you call in, like, the day before, or not the, is it the day, no, it's not the day before. Is it the day before? See, this is how long it's been. Either way, you, you, you call in, maybe it's, like, the week before or something like that. Or, no, I mean, I get, Brian, I guess you're saying day before. All right, so I guess it is day before. All right, so, call in the day before, and there's, like, an automated prompt, and, uh, there's, like, different groups and they're like, okay, group A, you're not needed. Group B and C, uh, report at this time to this place. Um, that kind of thing. And I've never been in the groups that were just like, you know, not needed. So I always went in. Um, but I've never actually been on an actual uh, jury before. I've gone and sat there all day waiting, you know, they 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 read like the the case that you would be a jury for and then there's the selection process um and all that stuff. Uh but yeah, I've never actually been there for an actual trial. Which really ain't too bad. You know, like I, I mean from my perspective at least. I, I, I complained about jury duty, but really, was it was it that big a deal that I had to go um, a couple of times? Not that big a deal, but it, it it's it's kind of like the dentist. Nobody wants to go to the dentist, <laughs> but like you don't even have to go that that frequently. Uh, you know, it's recommended like twice a year that you go to the dentist, and. Uh, not that big a deal. Jury duty beats the hell out of working. Well, so it depends on what you do for a living. But I remember, so, I mean, the last time I went, I, I wasn't, I wasn't making YouTube videos. Or actually, I think I was making YouTube videos, but like it was early on in my, in my video making uh time so like i you know i wasn't like making any um ad revenue from videos or anything like that yet um but like if, if that was if that like let's say that is your job or, or, or just anything like any kind of self-employment um you're screwed 
Because they give you five dollars, and you and you're like you're supposed to take that to your employer, right? And then like you actually get your full day's pay or whatever. And what I always heard in the past is that you could just say, you know, it's you're self-employed, you're not going to get reimbursed, financial hardship, that kind of thing. And uh, the last time I went, I heard people that got called up to be part of the jury uh, say that to the judge. And he said, basically like, listen, you know, I understand, but this is your civic duty or, or something like that. And you, you know, it's not a reason to, to, to get out of jury duty. Um, so then they were part of the jury. And it's like, damn. That that could really mess someone up. Um, if you if you like owned your own business, and uh, you know, hard enough making ends meet, uh, probably working more than than like forty hours a week, just trying to uh, get by or whatever. And then you got jury duty thrown at it, and it's not just like one day. <laughs> you know, some of these trials are. Uh, I don't know how long, but don't they go on for, like, potentially... I think it's rare that it's, like, weeks, right? But I think it's not uncommon for it to be, like, over the course of several days or something. It's tough. It's only in some states. Other states, you just flat out don't get paid for your lost wages. Mm. Hey, BG, what do you think about the new champs? Uh, Jaden, um, uh, Misty seems, pfft. uh, new cap seems pretty cool. If you want more details, well, I did an entire stream breaking him down yesterday. Not gonna go through it all again. Uh, alright, hold on. Voldemort sent it over a buck. Voldemort saying Twitter handle, uh, okay. Let me see. What is this? ABG, looking for some rank-up suggestions for solo mode. Looking to have a solid 30 champs prepped up. Here's the roster. Um, it's tough, man. I, I wouldn't recommend ranking anyone necessarily for the solo mode at the moment because we don't know the nodes. Uh, I mean, you do have some, some good ones potentially here. Um, I don't... I mean, I think Hit Monkey could be really good. He's already ranked up, but like, clearly there's a PI difference, so I don't think he's as high ranked. But, um. Let's see. I think Domino is gonna be a good one. Um, I think Domino is gonna be really good for the solo mode. I don't know how well a five star is gonna hold up. If you're already using champs that are this highly rated, um, which means you're going to be against other players who also have champs this highly rated, probably. And uh, yeah, in that case, I'm not sure if a five star domino is really going to hold up, but uh, potentially. I think Thing is going to be good uh, as well. Um, was there another? Yeah, there were more pictures. I think Havoc has potential. I think Mojo is going to be good. Those are the ones that, that kind of stand out to me. But again, it's too early to tell, man. Uh, we don't know. We don't know what, how the mode's going to look. We don't know what kind of nodes are, that are going to be there. The little in-game teaser made it seem like there's going to be a different... Um, Maybe like a like a different judge, which is maybe their way of incorporating the story into like an ever changing mode. Uh, so I would say, hold up till we see more info. Too early. Um, but yeah, those are ones that I think could potentially be pretty good. Uh, John Schlamp sent it over another loony saying Brian's a stripper. Pixie said so. Pixie Bell, no more polls. With the money being tossed at BG, it's like a strip joint. Wow. Okay. All right, Pixie Bell. You know. <clears throat> well, in honor of Pixie Bell. 
Let me see here. Okay, new poll has been posted. <laughs> the question is, or listeners at home, the question is, Pixie Bell thinks this place is a strip joint. Do you agree with her? I'll give you a moment. <clears throat> BG's stripper name is... Chris Bina? What? Just like Christina except Bean in the name? Weird. Oh no, the early votes are saying yes. No, guys, you weren't supposed to vote yes. No. Guys weren't supposed to say yes. Everyone's saying yes. It's over 70% that think this place is a strip joint. You know what? I'm ending the poll, dude. I'm ending it. Damn it. BG isn't wearing pants? Damn it, I'm not. I'm not wearing pants. I feel like Cap, Sam Wilson, has beyond God tier synergies, especially the Avengers one. I didn't think the Avengers one looked that great. Uh, where do you start with buffs for 10 minutes? Or 10 minutes. <laughs> if it lasted 10 minutes, then yeah, that would be pretty insane. But for 10 seconds? Like, there's ways to extend that with the, uh, what's it called? Synergy. Uh, <laughs> Mr. Fantastic Synergy. Um, if it's like a skill Avenger. But at 10 seconds, a lot, you know, that doesn't give champs time to ramp up. It doesn't give champs time to use specials. Um, I, it doesn't matter that you start out with some extra attack in the, in the first 10 seconds. There were a couple of really good synergies that, that I saw, though, but... Wait, was the Avengers one, was that also... No, that wasn't the one for with that had Beardo attached to it, right? Was it? Maybe that's the one with Beardo? There was one that with, with Beardo where it puts a stagger on the opponent on parries. That one I thought was really good for, for Beardo. Um I man, I wish Aunt Aunt May is not updated yet, is it? Hold on. <clears throat> I'm I'm assuming Aunt May will be updated by like tomorrow or maybe the day after or something like that. Uh, yeah, not updated just yet. We'll give old Slugberg another day or two. I mean, we'll give him all the time he needs, but I'm just assuming he's usually pretty quick with it. Out of context, that's probably the weirdest message I've typed in a while. Casual cashew. It was kind of weird. Oh, wait, do you, are you talking about this one? At Cloud of Contempt? I was trying to remember your uh, porn name the other day, and I couldn't. I just remember it was awesome. Wow. Okay. Casual Cashew. You alright? I'm liking the Source of Supreme with Silver Scent Synergy. Basically, you start with a bar of power. Yeah, it's great. Well, that to be clear, that's any of the Realm of Legend or <laughs> Realm of Legend, uh, Realm of Champions. They all synergize together. Um, I usually run uh, Storm Pyramid X uh, for that part of the synergy, but that's just because I, you know, I, I mean, I guess I have a Silver Centurion now. It's just I was so used to not uh using silver centurion because well sorcerer or um storm pyramid x came out first but i guess i could use that part of it too anyway uh with beardo you had 15 sec heal block on l1 and maximum of two staggers when you parry ah that's right the, the other side of it was heal block got it oh uh, yeah yeah Of 
course she reads that. Well, uh, BG, do you think it's high time they buff the OG Avengers? Yes. Yes, I do. <laughs> but like... <laughs> I don't know. Okay, so uh, talking about like the OG Avengers, who are they? Let's go look on Aunt May. I, 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 they need buffs, right? Um, hold on, hold on. Uh, there we go, Avengers. Okay, so yes, quite a few of these champs need buffs. Uh, they already did buff uh, a couple of them. They buffed um, Black Panther. They buffed Hawkeye. They buffed Falcon. Uh, they buffed... I mean, this is not like an... I'm, I'm, when you say OG Avengers, I'm assuming you're talking about the ones that came out super early in the game, like um, Ant-Man, uh, Black Widow, the old OG Cap, things like that. They actually did buff Hulk a while ago, too. But anyway, looking at the list of Avengers here... I would say, yes, there's a lot of them that need love. But to be honest, I actually would rather them buff up some other champions more than these guys. Uh, I'm pretty psyched that um, uh, Storm was on their list of champs that could potentially receive a buff. Uh, I'm assuming it's not going to be the, the best buff just because of the synergy that she has with APOC. I'm kind of hoping that they change that synergy with APOC uh, and, and give a little bit more love to Stormer's base kit rather than like still not doing a whole lot and, and, and mostly just relying on the synergy. Um, Storm's been one of my uh, uh, like most wanted to see buffs. So I'm really happy that they're they at least called her out in that in that forum post. And then where is it? Oh, it's not attached to her. I I, I would love to see uh this guy right here. I'd love to see Iron Fist get buffed too. So like there's a lot of champs that aren't the OG Avengers that I want to see buffed. Uh, and honestly, I want to see these champs buffed more than I want to see the Avengers getting buffed because they're always making new Avengers. They're always making new uh, versions of these Avengers, you know? So it's like, yeah, does OG Cap suck? Absolutely. But there's also Cap Beardo. And we just, you know, we're getting Sam Wilson. Um, who, I, I mean, I, I mean, that's, that's, I... What do you guys consider Sam Wilson? Do you consider him more uh, of like a, a new cap or more of like a new Falcon? I mean, it's both, right? But like... How do you, how do you classify it? I mean, I guess you just have to say it's both, right? Because I, 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 I was going to say uh, it's kind of a, more of a new Falcon because that's, that's who Falcon is. But then again, he's got the he's got the shield and everything. It's it's cap, it's both. But anyway, there's always new Avengers. Um, I want, uh, and of course, like there's always new X Men and stuff like that too. But just for some reason, I want to see these other characters uh, buffed more. Well, he's titled Cap, right? Yeah, I know. But in parentheses, it's Sam Wilson. Considering Captain Falcon, yeah, I I feel like that's I'm I'm gonna just be calling him Captain Falcon. New Sam is Cap per comics. I, I get it, guys. I get it. Like story wise, I totally understand. But just like in my head, uh, I I I was thinking like, what do I consider him like closer to? Um, as like a remake kind of character. I mean, it's a, it's a brand new character, but like, you know, we already have three caps in game um, and only one Falcon. So I was kind of thinking like, ah, oh, well now this is like, you know, but anyway, it really doesn't matter. Um, what was I going to say though? But yeah, of course, I want to see the Avengers get buffed too, but with the buff program slowing down, which really, you know, sucks. 
Uh, hopefully they can find a way to pick that back up. Um, I don't necessarily care to see a buff for like OG Iron Man. It's funny, you guys say that I have hate for like Captain America. But if you really want to talk about a character I have hate for, it's Iron Man. <laughs> I, I hate Iron Man. Brian is eating toes right now. How far are you shoving your foot uh, in your mouth right now? Shove my foot in my mouth. Billy's wise, he doesn't seem like either one, which is cool. Pretty different. Yeah, he does seem like a... I mean, I, ability wise, I I think he's closer. Ah, I guess he's right in the middle, dude. I was going to say, I guess he's closer to cap with the shield, but he's got the lock on ability. So he really is like just right in the middle. OG Iron Man was my first five star. Rip. RIP. Bro, I'm not getting 60 FPS in the menu anymore after I update the game. Huh. Do they cap the FPS. Interesting. EG, you don't think anyone's trying to harp on you for the new cap thing? There was some pushback against a black dude being called cap by real world Marvel fans, and that has uh, put some people on edge. Huh. Interesting. Unaware of that. Um, no, the, well, the cap thing, I think that was unrelated. I don't think there was ever any, uh, no one ever mentioned race before when they were talking about, uh, my hate of cap. They, they okay, the reason why people were saying I hated cap is because I said Torch is a better champion than Cap Beardo. Uh, and when people, uh, disagreed i kind of went in on cap beardo saying like he's not even that good it was never about a black dude that's an incorrect take yeah yeah i don't no one ever mentioned ra not in here i could i mean i don't know what goes on on like twitter and stuff like that did i just lose my streak i just lost my streak okay i don't know what goes on on like twitter and stuff like that I have no doubt that there's uh, all kinds of ridiculous people out there. But people are talking about my my hate of Cap just because they're trolling because I said Cap Beardo is uh, not even that good. BG, you need some good ideas on opening a basic or seeing the new featured? Need some good ideas? I don't know what you mean by good ideas. I, I prefer going basics all the way. I think it's just cheaper. I think you there's I think the featured is is just a label. That doesn't really mean a whole lot. Are the champs in there newer? Yes. That doesn't mean that they're better and you're paying more for it. Go basic. Uh, just meant a lot of people are very quick to defend the new Cap Sam Wilson champ. Partially for that reason, after the show, not your hatred, uh, for old capping games. Sorry for miscommunication. Okay. Got it. Yeah. I mean, I could see that, I guess. Um, but yeah, I, I didn't watch the sh I mean, not that watching the show has anything to do with it, but... You know, when you don't watch the show, you also don't look for things online that people are saying about the show and all that stuff. So I had no idea about any of that stuff. Sam became new cap ages ago. Ancient comic nerd here, just like Jane Foster is Thor. Yeah, I was going to say, I didn't think that was anything new. Which is why I'm a little surprised that that's even an issue. But at the same time... Knowing the world, uh, not not all that surprised. People are always going to be uh, people, right? 
Uh, lost my streak on round seven a number of times recently. Missed the parry and got smacked in the ground by six star rank three. Rip. Yeah, I, I wish I could blame game bugs for what just happened, but I basically just got barfed on, not paying attention. <laughs> and I don't even know what happened the fight before it because I really wasn't paying attention. But anyway. Uh, John Slam about ready to go to rank 3 for solo competitive mode. You guys are still talking about jugs, huh? I don't think Juggernaut's going to be good for... S Man, is he... I don't think Juggernaut's going to be that good for solo competitive mode. Uh, or Battlegrounds, I guess. Should we? I mean, what do we do? Do we start calling it Battlegrounds officially? But anyway. Um, uh, I don't think he's going to be that good for the mode. There's champs that can counter uh, Unstoppable. And although there, there's not that many champs with the slow ability to counter it, you can also counter his unstoppable just through other, like, normal power control means, just by preventing him from getting his special. I have no doubt that, like, Jugs can and will kill people. <laughs> he definitely can. Um... If you, if you don't have an appropriate counter as one of the champs that you uh, drafted for that particular round, um, then Juggs is tough, man. He's tough to deal with. I think people are going to have those types of counters in their decks. We'll see, though. We'll see. Yes, let's start calling it Battlegrounds. Yeah, I think so. I'm tired of saying solo competitive. I think it's gonna take like I think it's gonna take a, a a few more days for it to catch on, or like an official announcement, uh, which hopefully is in the works. But uh, yeah, we'll see. Anyway, Bushido Brown, seeing it over pounds, and I was watching a documentary on satanic rituals. I can't tell if this is a joke or because I mean this is the type of thing that there would be a documentary on, and honestly. I would maybe watch that documentary. It sounds interesting. Um, not that I'd be trying to perform them myself. You know what I mean? Just kind of curious. Like, why are these a thing? Anyway. Let's see. I was watching a documentary on satanic rituals. The participants had to place skeletons around the thing. But one of them started fighting the rest. I guess he had a bone to pick with the others. Okay. Got on my hopes that that was an actual documentary. Thanks a lot, Bushido Brown. Take a lap. Boo. <sighs> UG, can you check Twitter for me? Twitter name is Jesse MCOC. Okay, Jesse. Sure. Let's see. Hey, the new free-to-play account isn't looking that bad so far. I pulled a five-star Cosmic Awakening gem from the side quest. Should I use it on Medusa or save it? Thanks to the man. God, I just got hit with another special three. Um, Five-star Cosmic... Okay. Yeah, I think so. I would say use it. Um... I was hesitant at first to say use it because, well, there's also champs like Hercules and Null that exist that I, and, and you know, Hyperion, I think would be better suited for that gem. But honestly, you don't know when you're going to pull those champs. It's still so early on in your five-star collection that, like, um, you've got three here in total, right? So, I mean, they're going to be coming in slowly. And who's to say you're going to keep pulling more Cosmic Champs? Um, the chances are low. And Medusa's Awakened ability is a great one. It, like, doubles her damage. And, uh, 
She doesn't need any SIGs. So, yeah. I'd recommend it. Pop that gem right on into Medusa. Absolutely. Uh... All right, White Shadow sending over 252 of them Australian bucks. And BG, how are you? Twitter, please. Okay, let me see. White Shadow, White Shadow. There we go. Oh, dude, speaking of Null, there he is. God, what a badass. He can't even fit on the screen. <laughs> He's so tall, dude. God, why is this guy so cool? Damn, dude. Congrats. That is super sick. I'm learning from BG. I have 150k 5-star shards. I don't know if I should be apologizing for that or what, Scarco. <laughs> apologizing or saying congrats. Maybe both. But, uh, that's a lot of shards. Just saying, if you start a second account just for fun, you should already know what to do with your roster. Nothing against anybody. Uh, I don't know, dude. I mean, I'm, I've am i made a few new accounts, and I take input from people um, all the time on those new accounts during the streams. I need 500 more 5-star shards, and I don't know if I should do the daily class crystal or the general uh, crystal. Wait, what? Uh, I'm guessing that was dual class crystal and not daily class crystal, right? Um, if, if this is like your first one, I would say, like, you could just go for the regular five-star crystal. Don't overthink it. You need champions of all class types. Um, if, however, you already have some, uh, five stars, then it could be good to help round out your roster of class types that you don't have strong champions for yet, so... You know, if you don't have a strong mutant champion yet, well, then open the, the mutant skill dual class in hopes for a mutant. Or you can look at your um, uh, your class catalyst to help you determine as well. If you have, like, you know, a bunch of one class type of catalyst, you can open that dual class crystal. But um, early on, like the, your, your first few uh, five stars, really... Don't overthink it. Just pop basic crystals and you're good to go. <laughs> uh, wait, what? BJ, the new five star featured coming in a few hours. And is it really that close? Someone, I mean, when someone asked about it before, I didn't realize it was that close, but interesting. I wonder if I should get any last minute crystals, because I still don't pull Scarlet Witch. I kind of wanted to pull OG Scarlet Witch, but uh, I don't care that much. I guess I'm going to wait. What are you guys talking about with these names? What in the world? Uh, Alright, John Schlamp sent over 14 more of them Canadian bucks. John, thank you, dude. Saying, Brian, do a new account challenge with only Captain America's. Oh, man. Call it Caps Lock. Wow. Call it Caps Lock Challenge. Hashtag Caps Lock. Hashtag Messiah for Mod. Hashtag Jugs is God. <sighs> wow. The Caps Lock Challenge. Boo the name of it. Although I gotta say, it's actually kind of good. I hate to admit it. But that actually is kind of a good name for it. Um, dude, I wish that... like. All right, so I can't do that, of course, right? Caps only. There's, there's, 
Is there is there four? I think there's only four, right? We've got the OG, we've got World War II, uh, Beardo, and Sam. Why do I feel like I'm forgetting one? Or maybe it's just because we talked about other potential uh, Captain Americas, like the, like the um, what's her name? Psylocke? Uh, wasn't there one more, too? But anyway, we, we got like four in, in game. Right? Civil Warrior! Damn it, dude. Okay, five. That, I, I knew there was one more. God. I hate Civil Warrior, too. <laughs> I think New Cap? No. Well, yeah. I, I Honestly, I feel like, I feel like uh, Captain Falcon is going to be my favorite Cap. I don't know. Maybe it'll still be Beardo. But like OG Cap, World War II, Civil Warrior. Nah. Nah, 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 nah. Oh, Silek is Captain Britain. That's right. That's right. My bad. My bad. Uh, okay. Yeah, New Cap might be my favorite one. We'll see. I, and I still don't think I'm gonna play it much. It's just, I I feel like I'm gonna get you know, I'd, I if I if I could only have one in my roster, I'd want it to be him just because he has like some different utility. That I think could be useful. But anyway, so obviously I can't do that, right? Because there's there's only five then in total. Um, OG World War II Beardo Civil Warrior, and Sam. So we got five in total, right? But. Dude, I kind of wish that there was a way to set up some different rules um, so that you had to complete a certain piece of content to unlock, like, a certain tag type. Dude. I want to... I want to play a modded version of MCOC. You know what would be cool, man? Okay. I'm not really one for tier lists, as you guys know, but it would be kind of cool to take, like, Seton's tier list and say, like, in uh, uh, until you get the next title. Actually, let me go to this screen. Here, here, here. Watch this. Th dude, this would be, this would actually be so fun. All right, so we take Seton's tier list, or I guess we can use the official one in-game once that's a thing, right? Um, and say you're, you're a challenger. You can only pull champions from like the lowest tier. You got it. You got to use the crappiest champions in the game. Uh, and then as you get the next title, dude, you can start pulling champs of the next tier up. Uh, and it just keeps going from there. You know, the more titles you get, the more you're able to. Oh, whoops. Misclicked on that. Um, the like the better the champs you're able to pull. That'd be so fun for a new account challenge, dude. I would... Ah, man. Like, I, you know, of course I would never uh, want any sort of actual modded version of MCOC. Like, that's... When people say mods for MCOC, they usually means cheating, right? But uh, I'm talking about modding in like a, like a single player kind of way. The same way that they mod uh, like Legend of Zelda... So that they have, um, you know, or uh, Skyrim and stuff like that. Stuff that would not affect uh, the actual online game in any way. And just be like an early version of the game. Not any of the new stuff. Oh man, that'd be fun. We'll never be able to do that. But that would actually be a lot of fun. Did you guys suggest that you could ban the ability to add any competition uh, node to the practice arena? What do you think? Um, a bunch of people have um, ha had the same idea. Uh, calling it the, what's it called? The X-Men training room. What's it called? Danger room, right? Um, I'm, not, I'm not such a fan personally. It means that it means that like you have to practice even more 
to make sure that you're playing perfectly. Like you better you better train and you better practice with every single node available to you. I think part of the game is like you don't know how a certain fight's going to go exactly and you ha you kind of have to piece the piece things together through your past experience dealing with nodes and um you know, practice duels, uh, dueling the champ without the nodes. And then you kind of take that knowledge and you kind of just, you go, you, you, you know, you just, you try your best. And I think that's part of what makes MCOC um, good is that you don't just have every opportunity to master everything before it counts. A little bit of trial by fire is a good thing, I think. Uh, all right, Messiah sent it over 10, though, saying hashtag caps lock challenge, hashtag Messiah for mod, hashtag John for mod, hashtag Jugs God. Uh, do it, balls, man, do it. Oh, man, it's a lot of hashtags. <laughs> a whole lot of hashtags. All right, I never opened up that crystal. Let's go spin it out. But Messiah, thank you, dude. Thank you very much. Uh, uh huh. There it is. You guys have no idea how sad I am just staring at this broken chip uh, in front of me that's in these little pieces. <sighs> Can't wait to finally throw this out at the uh, as soon as I end the stream. Wrap it up, bald man. I'm watching Friends. Oh, Pixie Bell. I'm sure um, Rachel and Phoebe and uh, Joey, they, they can wait. All right. I hate that show, but I still know their names. Uh, all right. John Schlepp. Dude, John Schlepp's in over another 14 with what appears to be a John Schlepp special. Just the dot, dot, dot. Is there an actual message? Hashtag fellowship. Uh, I feel like that'll be a node. Oh, the caps lock one? You're probably right. Uh, that probably is going to be a node. I think that was just the John Slamp special right there, man. John, thank you, dude. What? BG hates friends? Yep, add it to the list. Sorry. I'm sorry. Maybe I shouldn't have mentioned it. I know it's a popular show. Uh, I hope you guys continue to enjoy it. I'm not going to say anything more about it. Enjoy it. Um, there's no reason that I needed to say that uh, I don't like the show. Not everybody's supposed to like everything, right? Hey, leave my friend's show alone, you goobers. Yeah, you tell him, Clarissa. Wait. I'm included in that, aren't I? Yeah, you tell me, Clarissa. <laughs> oh, man. I agree with BG here. That's my ex's favorite show. Oh, man. If that's your ex's favorite show, that's like a real reason to uh, not like it, huh? <laughs> oh, man. All right. Anyway, it's going to be pretty late. So, before I go, shout out to... John Schlamp for being tonight's biggest D. John. Thank you very much, dude. Night Hollywood. Night Dragon Tagger. Um, thank you to everyone else. Uh, appreciate the support as always, guys. Uh, finally made it through a whole BG stream. It's 1 a.m., but all worth it. Oh, man. Get some rest. Sorry for keeping you up. On that note, since you're still up, I was thinking about extending the stream another 25 minutes. What say you? <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. Uh, <laughs> let's end the stream. But, yeah. Thank you, guys. Uh, I'll see you all tomorrow. Eh? Okay. Good night, everybody.